going to talk about mileage reimbursement right now. And quite frankly, this has become a large part of our practice because we get so many calls from clients about mileage reimbursement. If you are hurt on the job and you are sent to a doctor, you are entitled to receive mileage reimbursement, meaning 40 cents per mile for every mile you have to travel to that authorized treating physician. Now, on top of that, you are also entitled to receive any type of parking fees you incur while going to that doctor. And if you have to go to the pharmacy to pick up a prescription or go to physical therapy, you're also entitled to mileage reimbursement for those travels. Now, this has to be submitted to the insurance company within one year of that appointment or going to the physical therapist or going to the pharmacy, and you are reimbursed at 40 cents per mile. The best way to calculate this is through Google Maps or Waze or another um, application just like that. Now, your attorney should provide you with a mileage log, which is a simple form that will put, be able, so you'll be able to put it all in one place and you can submit it to the insurance company. Now, the insurance company has 15 days to make payment to you after they have received this mileage request, but there is really no penalty until after an additional 15 days. Therefore, in all practical purposes, the insurance company has 30 days to make payment on the mileage reimbursement once it has been submitted. It, now, the other type of mileage reimbursement you're entitled to is when the insurance company sends you for an independent medical evaluation with a doctor of their choosing. Now, this mileage reimbursement has to be sent to you prior to going to that doctor, and you have to receive notice of this appointment 10 days before that doctor's appointment. Now, the same 40 cents per mile occurs, but you're going to receive a check before you go to this doctor. If you have any further questions about mileage reimbursement or anything else related to workers' compensation, please do not hesitate to contact the attorneys at Gerber & Holder.